So, good morning. Um, my name is Sabina. I manage investor relations for UVC Partners. We are an early stage B2B uh, tech fund with a focus on the DACH region. And we're here today to talk about why family offices could be a perfect investor for startups in the sustainability space. And I saw that the doors opened uh, five minutes ago, so I saw some people walking in. I'm, I'm thinking that it could have something to do with my guest. Uh, family offices are usually very shy, but we managed to convince one of our LPs. Uh, Dr. Ralf Becker is uh, managing director of the Schörkuber family office, Blue Lion. But before he's going to say a little bit more about Blue Lion, we thought we'd let you interact with us. So if you could just raise your hand if you are a startup, please, now. Okay, and who is here as an investor? Oh, great. Now I see who's uh, wanting me as a new LP. And uh, the, the other ones, the startups, if, we, if you don't fit within our investment focus, the best uh, home you can get is UVC. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Ralph, for that. Uh, so, Ralph, do you mind elaborating a little bit on what Blue Lion does? Yes, uh, Blue Lion, uh, first of all, is the single family office of the Schellkuber family. Some of uh, you might uh, know uh, our uh, Schellkuber group uh, since uh, one of the four pillars of the group is uh, the Paulana Breweries group and uh, therefore we are best known. But we are also uh, one of the uh, biggest uh, developers and real estate investors in Germany uh, with uh, uh, cities where we invest, especially in Munich, but also in Hamburg and in Berlin. And I'm a little bit surprised uh, to hear that we are not sustainable, uh, but maybe, Bernd, we will discuss this uh, uh, later on. Um, uh, we, uh, I said we have four pillars of the Schellkuber Group. We also are investing in the hospitality sector. Uh, some of you will know uh, the Arabella Group, uh, the Arabella Hotel Group. This is uh, one, and uh, we have also uh, joined ventures together with Marriott and Rosewood, uh, our, our new flagship uh, hotel, will be opened end of uh, 23 in Munich. Uh, it's the Rosewood, uh, middle of uh, Munich. And the fourth pillar is our, uh, our best venture we ever met. Uh, it's our seafood uh, uh, pillar. Uh, this uh, this uh, seafood unit was uh, acquired out of a bankruptcy uh, in Chile and we uh, bought it through Blue Line, built it up and uh, after it had a, a critical mass, we transferred it uh, in the Schellkuber uh, Group. And that's the approach we uh, make all our investments. Uh, through Blue Line, we make investments uh, in uh, sectors. We see uh, added value for the Schellkuber Group. We build it up and then transfer it in the group when they get the critical mass. Well, we're right in the topic, Ralph. I mean, do you mind uh, giving us a little bit of uh, a view behind the scenes of what happened with the with the what you just mentioned, how did you incorporate them or make sure that they're not sinking within the mothership of a corporate? What's like the benefit of a family office? Uh, we, uh, f first of all, we, we have no investment timeline. Uh, we, we can be a long-time investor and uh, help uh, the venture to build up, to grow and uh, get the, the critical mask. And, uh, as, as I explained, with, with this uh, seafood uh, business unit, we make it with all our ventures. We, we are invested uh, also in, in ventures uh, uh, of our uh, combine. We will combine with our real estate uh, uh, business unit, and there we work as a um, um, as an investor, uh, but, but not as, as a, a corporate group uh, who will press uh, the uh, venture. But we gave them uh, 
our network uh, so they can work with uh, the group. Uh, the, the group will work as a friendly enemy, uh, enemy to, uh, to them so uh, they can work uh, on their products. And uh, we also save them uh, first revenues uh, uh, with our group uh, uh, corporates. And uh, this uh, one, one um, example from the sustainability, uh, we, our uh, real estate department uh, was very uh, shy. Uh, w with uh, submetering uh, or, uh, or other things uh, in this sector until the uh, start of this year. Uh, but now we are very happy that we invested as Blue Line in three uh, ventures in, in this area and now uh, they are running us uh, to uh, bring them together uh, so they can um, use the solutions of these ventures within the group. Okay. Th thank you for that, Ralph. And um, actually, I have another question towards sustainability as a family office in like a, you know, um, big family like the Sherkhuber group. Uh, it's always in the media that there has been a trans transformational process being kicked off, that the third generation comes into power and takes more responsibility. Um, and I know Florian Scherkuber is quite often in the press, but they're also two sisters. So can you give us a little bit of insight? How do these three siblings, you know, maybe influence strategy? Is there more purpose and how does it influence uh, daily operations? Yes, uh, but, but uh, th that's always within a family office. We are not thinking in years, we are not thinking in decades, we are uh, thinking in generations. And uh, that, that's uh, the main reason now. Uh, the new generation is now uh, getting involved in uh, the leadership of the group and they uh, bring new ideas, uh, they uh, bring uh, a, a new approach uh, to the group. Uh, Alexandra Schöckhuber, as, as their ma uh, mother, uh, looked at uh, stabilizing uh, the group uh, over the last 14 years, but now we are uh, starting through build on the tradition the family has. And uh, that, that is the approach the new generation is uh, bringing into the business, how to develop uh, this solid ground uh, the, uh, the father and the mother built for them in, in a new uh, uh, stage uh, uh, combined with sustainability, especially in the real estate sector. Uh, we, uh, b uh, or the grandfather of the siblings uh, built uh, with concrete. Now we are thinking about building with wood. wood. And uh, this is uh, the new approach the new generation, uh, as an example, we have more ideas from them, but this is uh, uh, one of the examples I can give to you. Yeah. So, and when you're here today, I know you have a lot of meetings lined up. What is it? What do you look for in the teams that approach you? Yeah, uh, we we look at the uh, uh, possible value added uh, the, uh, the the teams will bring within the group. We have uh, a long-standing tradition. We invest in uh, uh, the quality of life, but we need new ideas. We need uh, new inspiration, and this is what we are looking for. And I think that we're almost out of time, so maybe in 30 seconds, we have 30 seconds. What's the main uh, takeaway that you want the audience to take away from this today? Uh, as I said, uh, uh, actually, invest in uh, quality of life. Uh, that's the best you can bring to people outside. Thank you so much. Thank you.